You know, I think we've made great strides forward in the conversation we've been having about um, our health more broadly and in particular mental health as men, but we still have such a long way to go. There's still significant stigma and negativity associated with us talking about the challenges we face. We know that men are still overrepresented in suicide rates and the negative impact of mental health, yet we're still reluctant to have that conversation. We all want to be our best every day, but we're human and we won't be. Often we're reluctant to even recognise the indicators in our behaviour and how we're feeling about the impacts on our mental health. But as brothers, as colleagues, as friends, we can surely see it in others. I appeal to all men to recognise that we have a role to support each other through the impacts on our mental health before those things can manifest themselves in serious consequences that don't need to happen, whether that's on our health, whether that's through suicide, whether that's involvement in criminal behaviour, such as domestic violence or substance abuse. We can only do this together and we can't leave our male friends, colleagues and family alone to face the impacts that we do today.